Yo, 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 what up, it is your man, duh, step in it, step in it, <laughs> what up, y'all, if you do, welcome, if you're turning, what up, though, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, go and check out that freestyle, boom, in the description below, but here we go, another react video, our silent farts worse, now, I'm gonna go out on the limb, I've seen a video when it was about, on um, farts and stuff like that, and it was basically saying, um, because, you know, they always, you know, these things, he eventually, if you watch enough, run on. But anyways, um, matter of fact, I'm not gonna spoil it. I know, but I, you know, I don't gotta prove I know it. Let's just get into it. That's for anyone. You may have laughed at the idea of silent but deadly farts, but is this faint flatulence really more potent than the more boisterous wind you let loose? Are silent farts actually worse? It may surprise you to find out that a large portion of farts are the result of swallowed air. Whether from chewing a lot of gum, drinking pop, or simply from eating food, excess air enters your body and has to go somewhere. And while some is released through burping, the rest ends up in the digestive system and eventually comes out your other end. But when expelled, this gas is made of mostly nitrogen, hydrogen, and carbon dioxide, all of which are odorless. Which explains why some farts are obnoxiously loud, but contain little to no smell. The second half of the equation is gas from the large intestine. After traveling through 25 feet of small intestine, the indigestible portions of food make their way to the colon. Here, millions of bacteria feast on the remaining food and ferment it. And this is where things can get stinky. Though the bacteria do release some useful vitamins, they also produce chemicals containing sulfur, which is responsible for the smell in flatulence. Add to that a sulfur-rich diet with mm -hmm. things like eggs, meat, or broccoli, and you're likely to produce some interesting odors. The longer <laughs> these foods stay in the gut, the more they ferment and smell. Mm. Still, the smelly portion accounts for around only 1% of most farts. In the absence of the other odorless gases, however, these farts are concentrated with smell and generally quiet because there is less volume. Silent, but deadly. <laughs> <laughs> that loud gas can be just as smelly as the quiet ones if the sulfur components are there. Simply put, your loud farts likely contain a higher proportion of airborne odorless gases, whereas the quieter flatulence tends to have a higher proportion of the smell. Got a burning question you want answered? Ask it in the comments or on Facebook and Twitter. And if you want the inside scoop on upcoming episode ideas and behind the scenes, check out our personal Instagram and Twitter handles. And subscribe. For more I like these, videos. man. They ain't been showing my cheerio dudes. Uh, I guess they used to show themselves in the beginning. Then they got comfortable and they just came out. Literally. But, uh, <laughs> this is 2013. So, yeah, they, you know, I guess when they did it, started doing it, you know, they didn't know how people were, you know, ooh, look, storm. Mm. I love my black women. Gotta leave black women in silo. But, um, black women are amazing, man. There's something special about them. Everyone wants black women too. No, but um, it is what it is. Um, what we was talking about? Fart. I just don't fart. I try not to fart in my clothes no more. Cause my thing is, you know, that stuff be sitting in your pants, man. Like if you if you got gym shorts and you smell them right now, woo. You know what I mean? Go wash your gym shorts, bro. I mean, you, you smell your jeans or something. You know, you be like, God dang, and I don't be wanting, you know, I don't want my booty stank. You know? God forbid, for some reason, someone is sitting down and, like, you know, I get on the bus. So, let's say someone's sitting down and I got to, you know, I got to do that scoop. And I scoop by and I'm like, whoo, what was that? I, 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 I can't rock with that. You know what I mean? Just just the thought of maybe my booty funky. Just, nah, bro. I just, I even try to hold my farts and just, I rip my, I just pull my pants down and just scrape raw booty meat hanging. My booty ain't that big anyways, thank God. You know, if anything, my brother's always cracking on me for not having a booty. I'm like, cool. I mean, at least I know ain't nobody been back there. So, hey, no suspect here. Yeah. But nah, man, not having a booty is not it's not what it's cracked up to be. Like, every time I bend over, you know what I mean? Like, when I'm working, I bend down or something, my pants instantly just fall off me. Because there ain't no cheek to, like, you know, kind of hold the jeans or nothing. Just, ha! I can't even. I could not wear not. I could not not wear a belt. You know, I don't know if that makes sense. But that they just. And I got plumber crack too, so it's that long. This is this is all wrong. It's just you know, we go go. This is. I'm sorry if I give y'all that image. My apologies. Can you imagine that if I'm just? <laughs> I'm sorry. I put that for the go go. Check out that. The, uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> You know, check it out in the description below. 
Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Two figures to the side. Does. Ah.